Hi, I'm Dale Popovich. Welcome to my studio today. I want to show you a few tricks and tips that you can do on the iPad to get a better composition by cropping, flipping, creating a new format, and getting new proportions. Because you never take the right picture and you can always make it look better. Okay, let's get started. This is very easy. There's a few little tips I need to show you. You hit the picture or tap it and you will get the edit menu bar up here. And you're going to go down to this little icon at the bottom on the left. And this gives you the possibility of changing what you want in the composition. So in other words, if I want to take this down to right about there, if I like that, I could take a picture of it. and I can just keep on adjusting the picture. If I want a vertical, I can go like this and maybe up a little bit like that and take a picture. And I can continue doing this till I'm all done. Now, let's go back to done and go, let's go back to edit again. So I can hit revert the original photograph. It takes you right back, so you go back to edit. And what happened here is that I had it flipped. If I want to flip it back, I go back to the top icon on the left. That flips it back to the original um, photograph. Now, the original photograph that I took, I actually liked it moving this way because you kind of get in and around and it leads you back. And I feel it's a better composition to lead the eye in this fact. In fact, I did a painting of this in reverse like this. That's what I came up with. So you can do all sorts of things. Now, one of the things that you can do in this, I'll revert it back to what it was. And I could take this to make it a square if I want. Or I could take within this, I can move this around within the, the picture plane. As long as I get the picture moving, I can take all sorts of things if I want to lower it to more of a horizontal and crop everything down to make it a little bit different proportion. I can bring this up so I don't have so much foreground in the road. But you can adjust your composition because nature doesn't make a perfect composition. As we all know, we have to make adjustments. And I'm always telling people it's more important to leave out than what you put in. Okay? So you really want to take a close look at your photographs you want to analyze them. How much do I need to do? How much don't I need in the photograph? And you can crop things out. And as I always tell my students, you're not painting the photograph, you're painting a painting. So make the adjustments. And that's my quick tip for today.